The most common disputes that we see relate to uh, claims where someone has fallen out and it's within a partnership setting and they can't agree how the partnership should be divided up. Secondly, where someone thinks they were going to inherit a farm but they don't and it goes to another member of the family instead. And thirdly, disputes that relate to a person that is diversified and they've ordered um, goods and they arrive and they aren't up to scratch or they don't arrive on time. The value of land prices has led to the increase in disputes given that when you bring a dispute and it involves a farm, it's likely to have land attached to it and therefore the value of the claim is likely to be significant. The best way to stop disputes arising is to record the party's intentions right at the start. So if someone is to inherit a farm, then it should be set out who is to inherit and on what basis. If there's a partnership, then you should really have a partnership agreement to set out who has contributed and how they should take profits. And if it's dissolved, then what happens when the partnership doesn't exist anymore? And also you should have discussions on an open basis with your family so that everybody knows what is happening and there aren't any surprises for anybody.